Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for All Sun, Moon, and Rising Capricorns. This is the month of August 2017. The month begins with the energy vibration of a water energy because it is the energy uh, for the inner light. So you will be looking for inner wisdom in this month. You Capricorns are very spiritual people. So you will be looking for your inner light in this month of August, whatever is happening. Um, a lot of endings and new beginnings are happening. Um, positive things, new contract and that sort of a thing. You'll be seeing the light to relationships. Um, some people will be asked for 10 early. Um, there is good opportunities. New people will be coming in your life when it comes on to love. So it's going to be good because you're finding your inner light and finding who you truly are. Um, the energy vibrate this zodiac energy is going to be passion because in this in this month uh, of December it's going to be wonderful uh, the first week is going to be a surprise coming in in the first week for you in the second week well, there's going to be contracts but also um, the accident of your and in marriage so there is going to be someone or coming in but as we look at the whole energy vibration you are going to have the two of cups so for you Capricorns it's going to be love for one and business is going to be a love and business for you guys so whatever is happening you guys are going to have the energy of love and business is going to be the foremost situation that is happening love and business this is good because you have the two of cups which is good um with the energy of the two of cups so a lot a lot of doors of opportunities are going to open up in loves for love for you guys and also in business for you guys so this is going to be positive business and love is going to be extremely vital whatever is happening there is going to be good situations coming in a positive situation that are coming in so you need to be aware of this okay as we look at your month it's five weeks in this month the first week you have the earth energy which is a very positive you're going to receive a surprise second week it's a week of love where a lot of people are going to be connecting with relationship and connecting with people new people are going to come in your life the third week you have the energy of the tower and the ending of people who were stabbing you in your backs and all that sort of a thing a negative influence that has been in your life there is going to come a swift ending to it um, the tower energy is here and also a swift ending so whatever that was happening to you that you had the ten of swords it's now in reverse and a swift ending is coming to that in the third week we have a situation which is a little situation that whatever it was whatever unbalance there was is going to become a balance and it's the end so you're moving away from it and it, it has an effect of something a situation where it's in it's 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 in um, you travel whatever because it's, a lot of people are going on journeys I realize in that th this month of August and it can be inward journey and it can be an outward journey so it's whatever it is um, and whatever that was injustice is you're at a hand you're ending it whatever that was injustice and that sort of a thing you're ending it it is at an end um, there's an, a balance coming in so whatever that was negative and whatever that was happening there's a balance coming in and you're going to see positive endeavors coming in your life now which is so so positive so the last week you are going to have the energy of a secret coming out and it can be a book for some people if you are about to publish your books in the, the last week is going to be good um, um, it's also balance it's also that whatever it is you have a very strong balance in this week and whatever um, whatever that was affecting you um, that has come to an end in the third week and whatever the situation that was was going on um, whether you know here or whatever wherever you are let's say you went on vacation or that sort of a thing some people will be going on vacation that is going to be coming to an end some people will be traveling that is going to come to an end so 
whatever the situation was it's going to come to an end but it's going to be good it's it's not it's, it's going to be good okay whatever the situation is and was it's going to be good in the fifth week because there is going to be balance a strong a strong foundation a step a, a strong foundation and whatever the secret was whatever that it was it's going to um it's going to come out in the last week of August and it's going to come out so it's it's going to be good because you are going to have positive um, a lot of new opportunities are going to open in your life a lot of new doors of opportunities are going to open in your life and this is going to be extremely extremely good so we're moving forward and we're looking at the first week the first week we have one of my car favorite cards that is in the reverse form and it is uh, the son of sword the son of sword is you know which one is that the son of sword this is in reverse so whatever it is whatever it was there is finally a balance and you're going to have a wonderful surprise so this is good whenever he's in the son of sword is in reverse this is going to be wonderful because whatever whoever was spying on you whoever was doing whatever or listening to you and that sort of a thing there is going to be an end to it and there is going to be balance and there's an end and you're going to have a wonderful surprise at the end of it an extremely wonderful surprise so expect in the first week because it's the energy of the hurt energy which is your um, best week the first week the second week and the two last week are your best week because then you will be vibrating in the zodiac energy of the hurt and the first week is the energy of the hurt and you're having the sun of sword in reverse and this is good this is positive wonderful news is going to come in a surprise is going to come in in the first week and this is going to be extremely good so it's going to be the end of whatever situation that was going on it's going to be good as we look at the second week what do we have in the second week we have the energy of the two of sword and the two of sword is a um, something with a relationship you're seeing something about a relationship and this is good so let's say you are in a relationship and you finally see that you know this person is the right person for me uh, for and, and I'm, I'm going to take uh, I am going to choose this direction in this relationship so that is for some people that's what's going to happen and it's positive so whatever is happening in a love relationship you're finally seeing the truth of a relationship you're seeing that this person is really the person for me love is going to come in a lot of people are going to be acts in the ends of marriage this is about relationship if it's work and they have situation to do with work it's going to be the energy vibration of you finding the right person to partner up with work okay so whatever the situation is you're going to be very very positive and it's all about love it's all about finding the right person and joining ends and matrimony with the right person in this week so the second week is also good the third week as we look at the third week we have the energy of the the ten of swords in reverse which is good so whatever that was going on the energy of the tower came in and um, you know bring an end a swift end to whatever negativity that was going on which is extremely good because what is happening is that finally there are situations that are happening and that was happening in your life people were stabbing you in the back were lying about stuff people were doing so much things and the energy of the tower came in and bring an end to that a swift end to that and this is good so whatsoever that was happening that you weren't aware about that was taking place the energy of the tower comes in and bring in a cleansing and bring the situation to an end so there is no more the ten of swords are falling out of your backs because people were lying and saying things that wasn't uh, true and that sort of a thing and in the third week you're going to see that healing coming in in the fourth week um, it's good because you have the six of swords you are coming to the end of a negative situation and a negative journey in your life and with this negative journey in your life um, this situation 
has to affect some people that were uh, abroad or some people that to um, travel maybe you went on a, a vacation it was so horrible it can be the end of your vacation um, it can be a situation that you have been going through for a very long time and it comes to an end and it has something to do with people in foreign countries different situation that sort of a thing that was happening without you knowing people were you know doing things and saying things and lying about stuff and it finally comes to an end okay because the energy of the hurt energy of balance and justice honesty comes in and it ended in the third week so sometimes when because a lot of people are afraid of the towel tower the tower is the best energies to have because the towel brings an end to something that has been going on and when the energy of the tower comes in that means the universal angels and guides have cooperated together and said now it ends okay now it's going to come to an end whatever that situation in in the fifth week you're going to see that you have balance and success and it's good okay so you have overcome whatever that was going on you have overcome whatever that was going on so you will have ended a negative period in your life and you're going to begin a, a positive um, situations are going to now come in because whatever is happening you have connected with yourself you have asked the universe to step in and it has really happened whatever the secret was it's going to come out whatever the secret was it's going to come out in the last week of August and this is going to be good um, secrets were meant to come out people think that secrets will keep a lifetime secrets were meant to come out whatever that has been happening in your life and whatever situation that is happening and whatever secrets that was held against your will and you weren't aware they're going to all come out okay they're going to all come out so it's the end and a beautiful beginning to something and you have um, and, and endure things that is that you know you weren't expecting um, to happen in your life but you have learned the lessons and remember whenever you come out of a very horrible time in your life say thank you to the universe and thank you to the universal angels because without them you could not have survived okay so here we are the month of August for you um, Capricorns are going to be very good if you're deciding to publish a book the last week is going to have the best energy for you people so if I look at you know let me get my glasses and look to see what is happening in your life look to see what exactly um, love is going to a lot of people are going to be asked the ends of marriage which is going to be good um, surprises are coming in you have number 14 which is 5 um, 25 this is 7 mm, 6 and 3 is 9 10 to twice 10 twice 10 and end then coming in uh, so you have 7 and 10 8 and 8 7 10 and 8 so you have uh, seven you have seven ten and eight is going to be your number seven ten and eight so as we recap this month we have a surprise coming in in the first week of August of surprise a wonderful surprise now this surprise can have to do with um, a new job new work new connection in business and in work but also the ends of marriage um, the third week is going to be the week that is going to end all the negativity all the lies and everything that was going on the energy of the tower comes in it's going to be a swift ending and then we are going to have in the the fourth week uh, um, moving away from a situation that has been going on for a, a long time new information is going to come in secrets are going to come out but yet still new opportunities is new doors of opportunities are going to be opening up remember it's all about love and work in this month it's all about love and work so new beginnings in love and work is going to come in for you guys so it's going to be an extremely 
positive positive um, situation that is coming in so a new beginning uh, in love and work new beginning in love and work that is going to come in for you guys so this is going to be extremely good whatsoever you know it is for you Capricorns new opportunities surprise good surprise um, surprise from you know far away surprise you went on vacation it's going to be a wonderful nice surprise um, maybe you could get um, connection with other people new doors of opportunities are going to be opening up that sort of a thing so a lot of good things are happening in your life and another positive things and the fifth week there is going to be a, a celebration and the celebration is going to be a good celebration because you have uh, the energy of the four of one so your month was you know is it, a cleansing your month is actually a cleansing that has been happening but um, the third week is just one of those week where it's going to come to an abrupt whatever the lies and whatever that was told and that sort of a thing is going to come to an end love is going to be very 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 um, possible that the energy of love is going to be here um, for you guys love is going to be one of those positive things that is coming in in this month for you Capricorns okay we're looking at the Sun sign Capricorns to see what's going to happen for the Sun sign Capricorns and you guys are going to be working the Sun sign Capricorns are going to be working with Saturnus which is the um, your planetary aspect of who you are the Capricorns the Saturnus and then you have um, Uranus oh my gosh it's all about Saturnus and Uranus this is like your your um, your <laughs> Saturnus and Uranus is as if your career is going to change whatever career part you were on it's going to change these two coming in it's all about career but it's gonna bring you luck so for you Sun sign people whatever is happening it's all about your career with Saturnus and uh, um, Uranus and so but Jupiter is here and it's bringing you luck so I, I Jupiter has been coming up for a lot of people a lot of people are going to be having luck because whatever the connection is with your spirit guides the Sun energy of this is happening and Jupiter is here for you Sun people and with Saturnus Uranus and um, the um, energy vibration of Jupiter it's going to be wonderful for you Sun people okay as we look at the moon people and see what's happening for the Capricorn moon people what is happening for the Capricorn moon people we have uh, Neptunius and we have um, Librans so justice and love okay so this is good this is extremely good for the moon people who do we have we have Neptunius Neptunius is working with the planet of Neptune and what it is doing it is that you're psychic you're connecting with um, the unseen world the spiritual world and Neptunius is uh, the planet that has information from Atlantis and Lemuria so in your uh, sleep time you'll be going uh, to Neptune to receive the information that you're supposed to have then we have the scale of justice so whatever legal situation that has been going on whatever legal problems um, you're going to have a win so for you moon people if you have what legal situations and you have done um, you have been positive you're going to have a big win in August an extremely big win in August and the planet of love is here so it's beautiful for you moon people so whatever that was affecting you moon people okay whatever that was affecting you moon people it's going to work out in your best for deal because you have the planet of Neptune you have the planet of Neptune and then you have Jupiter Neptune and Jupiter in Libra so this is good um, for the moon people your intuition is going to be I 
for the people who uh, will be going in their sleep time to Neptune for the people who have legal situation you will have a big win and for the people who are looking for love it's going to be a wonderful month because I see here that a lot of people you have the two of cups as a year um, focus and your second week with love is that uh, um, you're going to see the truth about the situation and you're going to really realize and accept that um, someone who has placed in your life is the right person so this is going to be good so love love is going to be good you're going to win a lawsuit if the, you are uh, you know there's a difference with people and love and your psychic abilities is going to be extremely strong you'll be going in your night sleep to Neptune for information that is going to help you on your part so this is this is wonderful for you Capricorns this is extremely wonderful so we are going to look at what is your vortex energy for this month for the Capricorns and Moon Horizon what is the vortex message my thoughts join a powerful a pool of vertex of attraction so remember you Capricorns you need to keep your thoughts in the month of August on a positive side in the same way that the law of attraction is responding to the thoughts words and action that you were offering here in your physical reality the law of attraction is also responding powerfully to your vibrational reality when the law of attraction the universe manage of all vibrational response to the clarity of vibration offered by your expansion in a beam the result is a powerful um, uh, um, swear of vortex attraction so this is going to be wonderful so remember whatever you do in this month of August you Capricorns it has to be positive send out what you want and not what you don't want because a lot of people seems to attract things that we don't want in our lives okay so this is going to be extremely positive whatever is going on for you guys out there it's going to be positive it's going to be beautiful whatever situation that has happened in um, the past uh, um, you expect a surprise a wonderful surprise in the first week a second week some people are going to be uh, connecting with um, your soulmate or your twin flame and your the ends of no they're going to be connecting with um, people asking you um, to join them uh, good um, connection in business good connection in relationship you're going to be asked the ends of marriage third week whatever lies and things that has been said is going to come to an end for it to be justice balance is going to be the end of a journey which is good because whatever that has transpired and the lies and whatever is come to an end and in the fourth week you have a balance because you have a balance a strong foundation and a celebration whatever the secret was it's going to come out and this is going to be extremely good a lot of openings if you're looking for work it's going to be a wonderful month surprises coming in it is good for you people love and romance is going to be the energy vibration of uh, um, your um, your month so it's going to be a very positive positive month I want to say to each and every person thank you for supporting my channel thank you for all the support please like share thumbs up these videos and I'm saying namaste until next month